getting it from iPhone Note Sport Air. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get background on your iPhone or iPhone Touch without using Winterboard. Um, the application or tweak I will be using today is called Boss Paper, which is free from Cydia. Later in the video I'll be showing you guys how to get that. A little explanation of what really Boss Paper is. Boss Paper literally just literally applies a background onto your iPhone or iPhone Touch, just an image or a couple of images and have a little fading slideshow. It also allows you to change your dock or make it transparent as well. This is probably a very good uh, alternative to Winterboard if you like using backgrounds than themes. Uh, theming is more of the icons, UI, uh, GUI, um, stuff like that, but this is more for just the background and the dock and a revolving background, so that's kind of what it is. So let's get into it, guys. So first I'm going to show you guys how to get the uh, application itself. You guys want to open up Cydia? Okay, guys, once I got Cydia up and running, you guys want to go down to search and search Boss Paper. Just like that, guys. Um, it should be the result under the B's. So if it is under the A, you guys will probably want to scroll down to the B right here. And you guys want to select Boss Paper. And you guys want to download and install that. And if you guys want to install any add-ons before we um, leave Cydia, you guys can go right into the Sections area. And you can click Boss Paper Add-ons right here. And you can scroll through these uh, list of Boss Paper add-ons. You can search for more in other repos, but this is just a general little collection of them. I have the simple and clean wallpapers uh, monthly, uh, collection installed just for this tutorial. So I guess I'll show you um, how to work them and how to install, um, apply them. And let's get into this uh, Boss Paper application. So I'm going to go back to my home screen and open up the Boss Paper application itself. First thing you guys want to do is want to make sure the slide, the little slider on off is turned on. And solid colors only. I really don't like this. It's kind of boring. It really is just solid colors revolving. But if you guys like that, go ahead, um, be my guest, and go ahead and use it. So here's where we really get into the cool stuff. Right down here is the folders and image selection. In the folders area, you guys can have a couple of images going, revolving and not just one just sitting there. So what you guys do with folders is you guys want to select folders and you guys want to go up to add right up here. And you guys can select from a boss paper add-on which we just installed. Um, a winterboard background which is taking right off winterboard. I don't have winterboard installed so there's nothing I really can do there. Uh, camera roll is all the cameras in your iPhone or iPod. Wallpaper is a default wallpapers that come with your iPhone or iPod um, when it comes shipped to you. And you can browse the folders if it isn't included that would be going into your um, system files and looking for it there. So I'm going to apply the add-on that we just up installed just a few minutes ago. And I'm going to hold, select it, and then touch add in the corner. And it is now remembered. And I want to make sure my individual pictures is turned off, which I do. I'm going to clear all. Yes, remove. And I'm going to leave the application. And it's going to say setting language, and it will change to what I want it to be. Okay, guys, it is resprung, and as you can see, the new simple and clean add-on has been applied onto Boss Paper, and it will now revolve to the colors. Now, if you guys want a simple color or a simple background that you guys have, um, and you want to apply it, just one image, you guys can do that through the individual pictures um, selection right here. And you guys will need to add one. And you guys can select camera roll or wallpaper or winter board, wherever you guys have that certain image um, saved. I'm going to select my camera roll, and I'm going to tap this image, and I'm going to click add, and I'm tap back, 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 and I'm going to unselect any remembered folders unremember these ones back and then leave the application and it will respring and there it is guys it has resprung and there is my background right there so guys there is a couple other features in boss paper um, there are some where you can actually change how much it can how long it takes to change each image where you can take the transition transition length what type of transition you want the fade Let's see what types they have here guys they have the fade, move in, push, reveal, ripple, sock, curl, uncurl, and you can tell what direction you want to come in. 
change on timer, um, that is a timer below, you can start using that if you want. Random, disable random, that really doesn't matter, you guys can have it on or off. Uh, dimming is on how much you want it to be actually, the opacity of the image in the background. Hide icon, icon labels, which is the text below the icon um, of the app. Dock labels is where you can see the actual title of the uh, application on the dock. Under winter board, I really don't know what that does. You guys can test that out. Aspect control, that means if it's an image that doesn't fit perfectly, you guys can stretch it, uh, or you guys can fit it, or you can zoom it, or stretch. I prefer stretch. So guys, that was the tutorial today, and see you guys in the next video. Peace out.